Okay guys, I'm here with the Turbo R4. And I've said it before in some of our videos, but one of my biggest gripes about these things is this wavy, weak little skid plate thing that just does that without even touching it. It just starts waving and bowing and, and all this stuff. So SSS, I've used them for my skids in the past. They have an option now. They have a full skid for these. So just so you guys know, it does not use the Pro R or the Pro XP skid. It has to have its own. So they've got it all mapped out and designed. Got one in the box right here. But first, I'm installing these standalone rocker panels or rock sliders, whatever you want to call them, side guards that come up and fit perfectly in that little section there. So it tapers down toward the back. So it looks like underneath there, you've got five bolts and washers that you just take out and these just go right over top. So it'll work with the stock skid plate or the aftermarket SSS, but no guarantees that it works with others. So I'm gonna put it on, shouldn't take more than a couple minutes and then I'll show you guys what it looks like. Okay, one thing to mention is that we take these five stock washers and bolts out. Um, you could, I guess, technically try and use the same ones, but they send you some little bit longer ones because it has to go through an extra three eighths and three eight inches of plastic. So recommend you use these ones. Plus it's a cool color. So I'm gonna throw these on. Okay, so I just got this side on. It took me like, honestly, a minute and a half, two minutes. So it fits right under that seam there. Looks factory. So underneath, that's a quick view. So these are a game changer. I think that uh, a lot of guys that don't live at Sand Hollow, you know, rock crawl, hardcore every weekend, this is a great option. A lot of guys typically go to the sand dunes, but they come out here once a year, Moab once a year. These are a good option for those sand guys that don't want to add a bunch of extra weight, but they do want to protect that whole side panel there, be able to slide over the rocks a little bit easier. Um, one thing to consider is when you're looking at rock sliders, you want to be able to slide over the rocks. So UHMW is a lot slipperier than aluminum or steel. So you'll get hung up if you try and install something metal on there. So highly recommend. Very clean look. I'm going to throw that on the other side and I'm going to test it out standalone this weekend before I do the whole skid so I can give you guys some more feedback, but awesome. I'm super pumped on it so far. So we went out, got this thing on the rocks, put them to the test. They work great as expected. Um, thanks for watching. So we're going to have a lot more content with this Pro R or this Turbo R. Um, so if you own a Pro XP, Turbo R, Pro R, be sure and follow along. Lots more to come. Thanks guys.